so I already did a video today this morning it was requesting a coder to contact me so we can create the scheduling app and then I dropped my kid off at school I was supposed to clean my house to go on this vacation but I've not cleaned it for the last two days I've been too busy doing other things and procrastinating and so I downloaded TikTok because I felt the urge to do that for a while it's where I think I can find my um the younger generation who is ready to change the world and has the tech skills to do it so I signed up for TikTok and that might not be because whenever I sign up for something with a goal in mind, it never is that. <laughs> like putting up the coding video. I posted on my Facebook, I posted this women in tech and I posted in game B. And the two people who responded in game B both gave me app things that, that to look at that are doing something similar, not the same thing, but something very similar, 29K, which is amazing. And I only just downloaded it, it was the incentive to do this video. Cause I'm like, all these things are happening really weirdly. He responded while I was on an idea cafe with these two amazing women who are dealing with the Kyle Cease fallout as well as what I'm dealing with. And that we made public on the idea cafe YouTube. We voted to make it public, but had that amazing conversation. And afterwards, Kim gave me two, two um, resources that were exactly what I needed. One around food and one around this coaching idea, which 29K, it looks like they also are the ones doing the work and it's already up and available. It's like online coaching that as far as I can tell so far is free, it's not for profit. And then I, so I downloaded TikTok to get close to, to figure out the, the generation, right? They're on it, they're like the teenagers and 20 year olds. And so I signed up, my room was a mess, and I used it as the incentive to clean my room. That was my first video. My first and only video is messy room, me snapping, and then my clean room. It's a horrible video, but it gave me the incentive to clean it. And then these four new resources that I have is also like, we need to get these things organized. The fact I've been out there looking for a scheduling app, and the one didn't solve the scheduling problem. It was more just um, coordination of video with people, and it could look similar for, for the layout. And the other one is I've yet to get to the video part, but it's basically how we evolve together and be happy through an app, but together. I'm like, yep, thank you, someone made it. And so thinking about how we can coordinate the organization, just knowing amazing projects that are out there and how do we get involved is both what the meta project is doing and also what I'm feeling called to kind of move on next and still concentrating on the four questions and just like not feeling the overwhelming pressure of needing to save the world but the gratitude of getting to do it in an easy fun way that works for me getting to follow the next step getting to just live my day and these amazing things show up I don't know if I'm going to find a coder to create the scheduling app no idea but it wasn't about that it was about listening posting it and then finding these other resources and just thank you thank you for the for all of the lessons the universe gives me despite the fact that I swear at it constantly. I'm like, seriously, these apps already exist. I've only been looking for them for how long? And like, I'm just now figuring them. We need to get this shit organized. So everyone doesn't have to go through this process. I am looking for these things and I can't even find them. I can't imagine if you weren't even looking for them and how they then find you when you also don't understand that the universe is giving you all the tools in the right time, in the right order oh, to be open to seeing these four resources. Five, I guess. TikTok was also a resource. All right. Take care. I will see you tomorrow. I'm trying to do only one video a day, but today's a two video day.